in the paint. Way off the mark. Edie rips the rebound away. Boilermakers on the move with a three-point lead. Smith will turn the corner. The reverse is there. What a seal there by Trey Kaufman Wren. And now Lance Jones with a heck of an effort play. All defensive team in the Valley making a big defensive play in the Big Ten. There's Owen Freeman the handoff to Perkins. Bowen, tough pass. Perkins driving to the rim. Killed the bucket and the foul. Horton almost got away with that one. Looks inside for Edie, poked away by Freeman. He gathers, count it, and the foul. He's too big, he's too strong, and he'll go to the line to add to the two. He just doesn't seem to make many mistakes when he's on the floor. He really doesn't. You have to think that you keep doing that, you're going to stay on the floor. I think Edie will stay on the floor. <laughs> just manhandles you, but here's that break. I mean, th there is no time to celebrate a made shot against the Iowa Hawkeyes. Oh, Purdue right now, 29-14. Perkins, rotation around. This is Dix, his shot blocked by Ethan Morton. Wow. These are the types of plays that Ethan Morton is on the floor for. He plays incredibly hard, and defense leading to offense. Purdue starting the break. A concern, certainly, for the Hawkeyes. Perkins. Driving inside, first coming over to help, didn't matter. That's a big time take, just right down that right lane line. So a high school teammate of Owen Freeman, but making something happen, getting into the painter area and getting it done at the rim. You know you've got to be a talented high school player. First time in over a decade as Coleman throws it down. What a start for Purdue. Defensive play, inbound, oh, wow. off the back of Sanford. What a heads up play. Push. It's Jones again. Drives baseline. This has been the Lance Jones show to start this second half. Lance Jones is exactly what Purdue needed after that lost FU. He's exactly what Matt Painter needed. A player that can push tempo, that can defend, give them a little more athleticism. And of course it helped out much better Braden Smith and Fletcher Lawyer are too. He's pretty good. Dumped down inside for the two-hand flush. Purdue just continuing to bludgeon this press. I mean, they, they are attacking it to score every time down. Oh, nice shot fake by Cricky. He is really skilled. And... There's Edie inside to the rim with one hand. And Purdue has just attacked this pressure. Once again, they're there at the rim, and it's another easy bucket for the Purdue Boilermakers. There's just nothing easy for Iowa right now about the offensive end of the floor. And it just feels so easy for Purdue. Man, this pass catch and one. They're just not going to win games if he doesn't score. And I'll say the same for Patrick McCaffrey. He's only taken, what, three shots? And that's, that's just not enough. And the two have combined for seven until that three for Peyton Sanford. talked about it earlier, who that alpha is going to be. We know who it is for Purdue. Iowa's still looking for that score. I think he shot 42% from three as a sophomore. Last year, that certainly dipped with his volume. But he's got real burst. I mean, he, he can really go. Here's McCaffrey on the run off the turnover. Sanford for three. And maybe a little rhythm. There's Cricky. Figures tonight for the 28th straight game. That floater drops for Brock Harding. Mike Hill, our esteemed studio <laughs> colleague. Mike Hall. No, 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 Mike Hall. I know, Mike I Hall, just yeah. wanted to do that because he messed my name up yeah. on the pregame show. Yeah. But he, he referenced Charles Smith in the Bulls game back in the in the 93 where he got a shot blocked all those times. That similar play. Cricky on the drive. Big collision underneath it. Strong enough to muscle it in. Tony Perkins with 10 tonight, 4 of 11 shooting. Freeman in the post, spins past Kaufman Wren. That's nice. That's, that's no joke either. Gosh, anybody who's lost somebody important to them knows what that young man's going through right now. Inside and first, flips it over the rim. Well, we're not going to get a historic Purdue win tonight like we teased earlier, but a dominant Purdue performance as the Boilermakers even their conference record at 1-1. One